by my house today. It's so good to see you all. I was thinking about you guys today. It was so hot today. And I was thinking, oh, I wonder if my friends are as hot as I am. Hmm, wonder if they'd like to do a story time to cool them off. So you know what I thought? What if we did a story time about creatures of the ocean? I bet creatures in the ocean don't ever get hot like we do. I bet they stay nice and comfortable as could be in that nice salty ocean water. So today, I thought I'd read you the story, and it's one of my favorites. It's by Kevin Sheary, and it's called On the Biggest Thing in the Ocean. Do you know what this is? It is. It's a giant squid, and they really are very, very big. But are they really the biggest thing in the ocean? Hmm. I don't know. Let's read and find out. Here we go. Ready? I'm the biggest thing in the ocean by Kevin Sherry. Here we go. I'm a giant squid. And I'm big. Oh, he really is big. I'm bigger than these shrimp. Oh, they are so teeny tiny. Let's see what else is bigger than. I'm bigger than these clams. Oh, he definitely is, isn't he? And I'm bigger than this crab. Uh-oh get pinched by that crab. And I'm bigger than these jellyfish. I'm even bigger than this octopus. He is bigger. And I'm bigger than that Shark! Oh, look at that shark. Look how fierce he looks with those teeth. Oh my goodness. And I'm bigger than these little fish. And this fish. And that fish. And this fish. And that fish too. Oh, let's see if he's bigger than anything else. The biggest fish in the ocean! Oh no, I'm the biggest thing in the ocean. He's not really a fish, he's a squid. Uh oh, look at him. What's happening? He's getting eaten by a whale, isn't he? It's a big blue whale. Look at how big that big blue whale is. Is he the biggest thing in the ocean now? Uh, I don't know. I don't think so. Oh, where is he? He is inside the whale with, look at all the fish, with the shrimp and the fish and the turtle. Oh, and the octopus and the jellyfish. Oh my goodness sakes. Look at them all. Oh, and look at them all looking at him. What do you think they're all thinking? He said to them, I'm the biggest thing in the ocean. And he said he was bigger than they were. Is he bigger than they were? He is. But is he the biggest thing in the ocean? No. But I'm the biggest thing in the whale. He is. He is the biggest thing in the whale, isn't he? Oh. Well, you know, boys and girls, remember all the different sea animals and sea creatures we heard about in the story? Let's make up a song about them. Okay, I'll start the first verse, and we're going to borrow the tune from, do you remember Wheels on the Bus Go Round and Round tune? We're going to borrow that tune, but said the wheels on the bus go round and round. We're going to sing... Um, let's start with a squid, since a squid was the main character in our story. Here we go. 
and they kind of float through the ocean. Can you float? Can you do this? Okay, here we go. The squids in the ocean go float, 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 float. The squids in the ocean go float, 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 all day long. Okay, what other sea creature was there in our story? Think of another. <gasps> You're right, there was a shark, wasn't there? The sharks in the ocean go chomp, 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 chomp. Chomp, 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 the sharks in the ocean go chomp, 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 all day long. What other sea creature? Oh, you're right, there were some clams, weren't they? And they go open and shut, can you do that? Open and shut. The clams in the ocean go open and shut, open and shut, open and shut. The clams in the ocean go open and shut all day long. What? Oh, I thought I heard you say that. You're right. There were crabs and what they were pinching. They were actually pinching the squid. What? The squid, weren't they? Okay. The crabs in the open ocean go pinch, 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 pinch. The crabs in the ocean go pinch, pinch, pinch all day long. A what? You said what? Fish, that's right, there were fish. And fish swim, don't there? Of course there's fish in the ocean. Let's swim with those fish. The fish in the ocean go swim, 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 swim. The fish in the ocean go swim, 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 all day long. Hey guys, good job. Well, you know what? I want you to finish that song sometime today or maybe tomorrow when you're thinking about it. Use the two wheels and the bus and see if you can come up with some other sea creatures that live in the ocean and what they might do in the ocean, okay? And you can sing that song. Right now, though, we're going to do a little rhyme. And, well, it's actually a finger play. We're going to swim, of course because it's in the ocean and we need to cool off because it's so hot today. So we're gonna swim. We're gonna knock, knock. Can you do this? Knock, knock. Got it? And now we're gonna go splash, splash. So you're gonna tap your knees. Splash, splash. So one more time, ready? Swim, swim, knock, knock, splash, splash. Oh, and one more part. Come on in. Got it? Okay, here we go. We're going to count with this too. Of course we're going to count, right? Okay, we're going to start with the bathtub. And in this bathtub, we're going to start off with one shark. One shark in the bathtub going for a swim. Knock, knock, splash, splash, come on in. Okay, we're going to add another one. One plus one equals how many now? Two, can you show me two? Good job, okay. Two sharks in the bathtub going for a swim. Knock, knock, splash, splash, come on in. Oh, here comes another one. Now how many sharks are there in our bathtub? Three, okay, here we go. Three sharks in the bathtub going for a swim. Knock, knock, splash, splash, Come on in. Okay, I'm going to add another one. Now how many sharks does that make? Four. Four sharks in the bathtub going for a swim. Knock, knock, splash, splash. Come on in. I'm going to add one more. Now how many is this? Five. That's right. Five sharks in the bathtub going for a swim. Knock, knock, splash, splash, come on in. You ready for the last? Five, four, three, two, one. Cannonball! Yay! Do you guys like to do cannonballs in the pool? Boy, I bet today that would have felt good, huh? Hey guys, I had really a lot of fun with you guys in story time this summer. I loved doing them with you. I miss being with you actually doing them. But if this is what I could do for you and I, how I could see you, this has been fun for me. Hope it's been fun for you. 
we did a lot of different things in story time. And you know, last week we did an elephant story time and I described what an elephant looked like and you had to guess. So there's a game you can play at home with your family to help increase your vocabulary. See if you can do that. Did you do that this week where you played that guessing game with your family? Where you gave them clues of an animal or a person or place or a thing and they had to guess what it was? Did it work? And then, you know, earlier on in the summer we did a shape hunt where we had different shapes for you to go look for in your house, a scavenger hunt. And then today we changed the words to a song. So maybe you can do that too at home. Maybe you, maybe you can use a different tune instead of the wheels on a bus. Maybe you can use the tune Twinkle Twinkle Little Star and change the words to that. And we did rhyming words too. We did ideas of words that sound alike. Cat, hat, mat, bat, sat. So you play the little game like that too, or you could. So for the rest of the summer, you have endless ideas of things you can do, play games to help you with your getting ready to learn to read. And also, don't forget to read those books too. Hey boys and girls, it's that time. Wave high, wave low. I think it's time we've gotta go. Wiggle your fingers and wink your eyes and blow a kiss and wave goodbye. Have a great rest of your summer, boys and girls. Goodbye.